What is up YouTube? It is a beautiful North Dallas, Texas day. It's about 55 degrees if I'm not mistaken. That's what the car was telling me. A little breezy, kind of cold, and uh, the last couple of nights it's been fairly close to freezing temperatures, so we're going to see what effect that has on the bass. They've already been playing hardball because of the rain lately, but we're not looking back. We're just going to go out here with the trench hog, I think, and the bandito bug. I'm going to try and throw a couple Guggen baits this morning, or this afternoon, actually, and see what we can't get. I think the time, local time, is about 2 p.m., so let's see if we can't get a bite out here at Sunset Point right off of 423 in Frisco. Texas. Alright y'all, we decided to try something different and come back to the spot where I caught my old personal best and I've got a couple things tied on right now. Just did uh, something different for you guys. I did a PB&J jig with a black and blue crack and crawl trailer with one of the sections popped off, just that top section. And then I got a uh, I got the natural color trench hog over here, Texas rigged with the weight pegged. I see some kids that are uh, fishing this spot, but I think they've already tried this bank here. So anything on this corner is probably undisturbed. We had something going after him, guys. Dang it. I wonder if it was a turtle. I hope I got my pinchers on here still. Down the barrel, waiting for the final gates to open. Last time I fished over there, I got kicked out quick, man. They didn't hassle y'all. They didn't hassle y'all today. That's dope. I probably should have brought the crankbait or something. I really haven't had many hits. I brought like a Texas rig and a jig. I'm kind of like not getting. <laughs> there he is though. Damn dude, like an hour in. Oh yeah. Oh, this hook got him good. Cool. That kind of makes it worth it. About to have to split and catch like a two pounder right there. That was my first one. You guys fish here a lot? First time here? Oh yeah. Nah, <laughs> have you? That's sick, dude. You guys been fishing for a while? Yeah. Yeah? got four each so far so. Four each? Yeah. Bro, I need to come out with y'all. I think I got that same backpack. Oh, you do? That, not that color, but like the same backpack. Green it's like green. Like yeah. And then I saw that and I'm thinking, oh man, I should have held off. You guys tried these Guggen baits yet? No, I haven't tried it. Dude, this is like the trench hog. I've been using a bunch of their stuff and it's pretty sick. I ordered them, but now they have them right there at Field and Stream. I saw it on the shelf. I'm thinking, oh man, <laughs> I'll just burn through them. Really? Well, uh, I gotta run to the house for a minute, but I'll come fish with y'all if y'all don't mind. I'll text you right quick. Florida. Yeah? Yeah. That's sick. That's where you grew up or no? Yeah, that's where I'm from. Yeah? Both of y'all or no? I grew up in Kentucky. Louisville! <laughs> Dude, I remember the skate park out there. <laughs> don't mess around 24 hours, right? Yeah. That's funny. What's y'all's names? Aiden Sean. Sean and Aiden? Yes. All right. Dope. Well, I'll catch up with you in a minute. Uh, hopefully, I can get back out in another hour or something. I that jig, I was feeling good about it, but I ended up getting them on the hog. It's not always what you'd expect. But man, I just met up with Sean and Aiden. They caught four apiece, dude, and they're over here using crankbaits. I knew I should have stuck to my roots, man. But uh, still, getting one on the hog feels good. Gotta run to the house real quick and then we'll try and resume things. Otherwise, that'll be the end of this one and we'll catch you on the next one. I'm not quite sure. About an hour later, y'all, it's about 4.45 and I'm gonna try and snag a couple more at Savannah before sunset. Dang, there went the leader and the crankbait. 
and I'm assuming <laughs> the crankbait is way out there but with any luck it'll float back this way and then with even more luck I'll get this out of here and I'll just tie the crankbait back on good start and the first few casts out here at Savannah <laughs> I think we might be cutting more line off of this uh, reel right here so let's skip the crankbait and let's go <laughs> let's go for the let's throw the jig I think I see the crankbait he should be rolling in in the next 20 minutes Oh, we got one on. There we go. Oh, two. Did y'all see that? Two. We j No. You guys, we just had two bass on the hook. Here we go. Oh, two. That was almost a double catch, but instead it was nothing. <gasps> <laughs> 